George, another name I go by is the storyteller at Morgan State University. Um, the name is self-explanatory. I have two short poems. Uh, the first poem is called A Shame. Story behind that, you know, you know, guys talk. And you know the whole, yeah, I met her yesterday and she let me hit the day. She thought I was about to run her up, whatever, whatever, you know all that talk. So uh, that the first poem comes from that one. And the uh, second poem is self-explanatory. But I kind of sing in it. I'm going to let you know now, I'm not a singer. So don't judge me. <laughs> uh, so the first poem is a shame. <clears throat> oh, and I haven't done this joint in, in a little bit, so if I mess up, act like I did it, because that's what I'm going to do. Uh, you good, man. My match. <laughs> My body screams she wants me, but I wonder if her mind feels the same. And I try to talk to her, she, she acts like she has nothing to say. But when sex comes into play, she is always ready to play, which, which is a shame. A shame that she'd rather give me head than let me know what's going on in her brain. I wonder why. Could it be a learned behavior she got from messing with other guys? A role she set up for after leaving all scripts were the same, so she skipped the talking, went straight to acting, and is now on her way to an Academy Award for the special the skills she displays. Or, or could it be that this is what she wanted from the very beginning? I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. There's really no difference between girls and guys nowadays. And especially from all the talk, it seems like sex sets up off or something slightly more than a want to a full grown need like the food we eat. So, this is a good chance to just try and make into that toy she can pull out anytime she pains it. Or, or could it be more? What about this only way she can truly express her feelings toward you? That there's no words in the, 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 that there's no words in the dictionary, the vocabulary that could exactly portray the way or paint the perfect portrait of love. So I ask y'all, what speaks louder than words? So I ask y'all, what speaks louder than words? Action. Action. Actions. Good luck. I needed y'all. Thank you. Actions. <laughs> Actions. But I'm guessing something went wrong during translation because I didn't know what's being said. The only thing I got from my little escapade was sexual being made. So in trade, I was put into a confused state. I didn't know where her actions, her intentions truly lies, which, which is a shame. Or could the biggest shame be, I slept with her without knowing her reasoning. Dang, a shame. And that's the end of the first one. Woo! This piece is called What Would I Do Without You? It's like, uh, it's a love piece. Once again, I don't sing like that, so I know you wonder why you put in a poem there, but I just thought it sounded good. Yes, right? uh, so here we go. It's like, uh, mm. what would I do without you? <laughs> what would I do without you? I mean, you like my sunlight on a cloudy day. Uh, chill, chill, chill. I know that sounds cliche, but she make me smile by my lip. You make me feel like a little kid on Christmas morning. Now you ran to the biggest present and anticipated. No. No new. It was exactly what she wanted. Oh, that song that stuck in your head. You know, first you start humming. Then you start singing. Then you start dancing to a song you can only hear. So you notice people start to stare, so you stop. Then you realize you're okay, so you just keep on going. <laughs> you make me sing songs like Love of My Life. Or, or tunes like I never felt this way about love. And Dang, I was, I was joking. I mean, hold up now, don't get a twist, I ain't with this. Just God bless me, see what I was blessed with. You know, something so real, something so pure. It's evident that I made this so it's like, it's like he directed the perfect symphony. You and I know so we may go so, so, and singly. We harmonize. So many people go through the time like not knowing how it feels, but takes and go to God. I know how it feels that someone can send chills in my very spine. Just me knowing that someone like you for always a part of your mind. Someone who can make me smile and bite my lips. Someone who can make me feel like a little kid on Christmas morning. In the present always wanted. On as God has granted. You, my love. What would I do without you? Thank you. Yeah! Woo! Woo!